Alright, my check one, two, one, two. Alright, perfect. We're good to go. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's George93, and I'm back with some more Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke game for you guys. We're now on part 18. And in today's part, we are going to be doing Lake Valorfront and Route 213. And the last part, 17. I'm a Fetty Wild fan. 1738. Uh, it was just Route 214. I didn't realize how long that route was. Um. I got HMO2 Fly from Veilstone City from the Team Galactic Warehouse from Looker. I got TM28 Dig from someone on Route 214 in the Ruin Maniac Cave from the Ruin Maniac. I lost Plump due to a self destruct grappler, but I brought her back to life using a life. And what we're going to do is every gym badge, we are going to get one life. And, you know, that will make my life easier. Um, I also cleared out Route 214. I also caught Smoke, the female Houndour. At level 24, Colby and Gianna Bryant. I'm very excited now. I'm on my vacation officially starting today, August 14th, 2020. Of course, when you watch this, it will not be that day. Unless you're watching the stream live right now. But off screen last night before I went to sleep, I did a lot of grinding. I just used the VS Seeker, started rebattling the same people, like the... Um, it's near the end of Route 214, like these three trainers, so they all gave really good experience, so I was like, you know what, let's do it. So before we begin, let me give you guys a quick team recap of this beautiful sex looking team. First up we have Plump, the female Babero, at level 35, I'm a Kevin Durant fan, baby. Normal water type with the Razor Fang, simple as her ability, rock and moves, headbutt, roll out, defense, curl, and rock smash. Next up we have Shelly. The male, Gastrodon, at level 35, Water Ground type with a Quick Claw. Storm Drain, as his ability, Rock and Moves, Hidden Power, Rain Dance, Water Pulse, and Earthquake. Next up, we have Star, the female, Star Raptor, at level 35, Normal Flying type with the Chesco Berry, Intimidate as her ability with the almost 100 attack stat. Rock and Moves, Fly, Area Lace, Close Combat, and Return. Next up, we have Blade, the female, whoa, hello. Blade, the male, but do I apologize, at level 35, Grass Poison type with the Sued Bell. Poison Point, as his ability, Rock and Moves, Mega Drain, Flash, Cut, and Sunspore. And that beautiful smart ribbon. Next up we have Bullseye, the male Ponyta at level 35. He is 5 levels away from a Rabidash with the Chesco Berry. Flash Fire as his ability. Rock and Move Stomp, Tail Whip, Fire Spin, and Flame Wheel. And hopefully we're 1 level away from Blade to evolve into Roselia. And last but not least we have my starter Pokemon, my partner Pokemon Shady, the male Prinplup at level 35, pure water type. Um... I mean, he must use an item. Torn as his ability. Rocking moves Bubble Beam, Brine, Defog, and Grass Knot. Or his newly acquired move, Brine, which he learned off screen. I, no, no. Never mind. He's not learned off screen. Never mind. Uh, do I have anything? Or a good old print plot? Hmm. Old Berry for now. And, um. Let's give him a cherry berry. Alright, so we're gonna do uh, Seven Stars Restaurant. More flavor than you can wish for. I'm very sorry, we're now close. Please do visit. Oh, I forgot to open during the day. Ha ha ha. Pretty much you can just battle a bunch of trainers in doubles. This guy's around 15. I'd rather be in a pool than in the sea. The salty tang of the sea tastes like my tears after a hard day of work. Okay, well, that's kind of scary. Um, well, we have an item. My chair keeps rocking and making that stupid noise. I found a PP up, which is excellent. I love using this item to increase my moves, you know. Power usage. Power points. Oh, uh, nothing. Nada. Nada. Here. We'll go in here. We have to find that sweet key. Hi, I'm the game director. Oh, you're working on filming Pokedex? I hope you'll come to show me Pokemon when you fill it up more. Wow, okay, so the game director's here to go himself. Um, I guess when you complete the Pokedex, 
Uh, did he get a diploma or something like that? I don't remember. Okay, round 213. Let's keep exploring, of course. Me, I'm just a simple guy. I let my guitar do talk and all I need is music and Pokemon. I can try wherever I go. I have things, those things in my life. I hear there are guys like me who go around in Pokemon centers. Let me gaze into your eyes. I read your fortune. A magical encounter is in the winds, though I cannot tell whether it be a Pokemon or a trainer. I guess he's indicating that we'll run into Giratina, spoiler alert. And I'm going to probably Dialga and Palkia. We're a traveling trope of street performers. In place of formal introduction, introduction, please take this. Okay, TM92, I believe that's a trick room, I think. To trick room, which means the lower speed goes first, higher speed goes last. Trick room was a doozy of a weird time twister move. Used in for a while afterwards, the soul Pokemon moves first before the fast one can. The soul one gets to attack. How you use the move is up to you, trainer. Well, thank you, mate. I accept free items. You would think there'd be a hidden item. Oh, okay, there is. What? Up one, left one? Oh, I found the sweet key. Oh, so that's where it is in this game. Okay, well, let me... Let me get the girl the sweet key. What am I to do? I've gotten to draw my sweet key somewhere again. Oh, that's the sweet key. You found it for me. Oh, that's sweet. Thank you. They found me out. Here's something for your trouble. Got the white flu. I believe flutes are unlimited usage. Blow the white flute if you want to attract more wild Pokemon. It's a rare flute. It's a rare glass flute that you can only get in the Hoenn region. Okay, so that's an Easter egg for a Hoenn. I like that. Um. Okay, that takes care of that. We don't have rock climb yet. Is that right? You're a travel. Oh, so you've got to come to other places. Do you know about Mount Moon in the Kanto region? Clefairy Dance on the Moon is something I must see in my life. Another easter egg to, to the Kanto region. I'm good. I believe this man heals you. Oh, hello. You were safe for a night, but we have no reservation. I'm afraid we are totally booked. You may rest for a while if you wish. Thank you, sir. We hope to see you again soon. The hotel is so romantic. I hope a night and a Pokemon will sweep me away from my honeymoon here. Wow, well. Have fun. On a yellow shard. Hotel Grand Lake, another world on Lake Valor. Come on, really? Nothing? We have some water trainers here. Blade, you know what to do, matey. E, I can battle too. I can too, mates. We translate two bird Chelsea with one Pokemon and with a marrow. Oh, the bubbles, I see. Level 28. Alright, now the levels start going up. Let's go for a Mega Drain, shall we? Alright. What? Bubble Beam, that's fine. That's fine, mate. Another Mega Drain. Get that HP right back. I can't freaking drain. Alright. Mara was defeated. And defeated Tuber Chelsea. Losing made me all hungry now. 112 Poké Dollars for winning. The cloud looks like a giant ice cream. I bet it tastes yummy. Okay, that's an Easter egg to Vanillaite. Gen 5 of the Universe region because I can Pokemon. Of oh, Vanilla, Vanillish, and Vanillix. Isn't that nice? I love my inflatable tube. Alright, mate, let's go! We were trying to play Tuber Jared. Three Pokemon. He has a Shellos. Level 25. He has the West version. I have the East version. We're gonna go for Mega Drain. What? 
stand. I see. Alright, Shalos was defeated. Alright, well, apparently it's not gonna one shot. Um, which is unfortunate. I'm just gonna go into Plump. Nice. Shell loss number two was a DK Din. And a third shell loss. Is it the East one this time? It is, I remembered. Oh, level 26, and it has the bubbles. And shot loss number three was defeated. And defeated Tuber Jared. It's not easy trying to hold my inflatable tube. I don't know, 104 crocodiles, whatever. He, I don't know, they, the tubers never give a lot of heat that. Mom blew up my inflatable tube for me. I ran out of bread, just opening it. Okay, guaranteed is an item here, I believe. On a pearl. Alright. Wait, 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 wait. So that means one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four. Heart scale. Excellent. A pearl, a heart scale. Is there anything else? Another pearl right in front of it. No more items. There's a fancy hotel and a fancy place with a fancy restaurant. The fancy restaurants filled with fancy people who think of themselves as being too fancy to battle. Okay, that was a lot of time saying fancy. Whoa, now just now. I was about to reel it in. Oh, are you now, mate? Challenged by Fisherman Kennet. Great Pokemon. Remory level 25. Pure water type, I believe. Swift swim has ability and suction cup has ability. So, suction cup, low end artillery. I believe your opponent can use held items. Remory was defeated. Ram or raid. Rem. Rem or raid. Ability. Remember raid. Oh, never mind. It can have hustle as its ability, which means lowers accuracy but moves will do more damage, increases attack. Sniper increases critical hit ratio and Moody's his hit ability. Raises one stat and lowers another one. Interesting. Another Remember raid probably has Remember Remember and Artillery. Another Remember raid level 25. I really want Blades to evolve into a Roselia. Alright, Remory was number two was if you didn't. I lied. Gyarados was supposed to come on out. Oh man. Um I'm intimidate, so um Damn. Oh, I don't know. Let's go in the star. Gotta face off ears. Oh he's intimidating right back. Gyarados level 20, water flying type, intimidate as its ability, or moxie as its ability. Every time it knocks out a Pokemon, it increases its attack stat by one. Mine has that for competitive in Sword and Shield. Fight, that's fine. Good job. Stab return. It's a beautiful thing. Alright, Gyarados was a DPT. Wow, 1284 experience. I defeated Fisher Min Ken. Need to have more respect for grown ups. Of course I do. Go on, don't be shy about going up, but people to hear what they have to say. Just don't talk to me. Wow, this man is heated. I apologize, mate. 
item. One, two, three. On a hard scale, excellent. Um, let's have another one. Yep. One, one, two, three, one. I found a pearl. Dr. Footsteps House. Footprints reveal all. Dr. Fissa, Pokemon are quite easy for me to read. I need only to see their footprints and their innermost thoughts are revealed to me. Oh, you are skeptical of my claim. Then let your Badoo walk in front of me right here. From his footprint, I'll determine how he feels towards you. If I said there can be friendship between Pokemon and people, will Badoo's friends understand? But if you see Joey and Blade, will understand. Because Joey and Blade are friends. And that is what your Badoo thinks of you. I must say, Badoo and you share a very close bond. This is for you. Got a footprint ribbon. On um, Badoo. Badoo has two ribbons now. Excellent. Where was that massage? Was that in Veilstone, I believe? Oh, yeah. The footprint ribbon now. And the smart ribbon. Badoo, you animal. Well, I want to play it safe. And I know it right there. I know. I apologize. I know. I really need to knock out and get a Roselia right now because I'm getting really annoyed that Blade has not evolved yet. Might as well heal since we're here, you know what I'm saying? I'm debating on what to do now. So, I mean, this route is pretty much cleared up. So, Pastoria City would be the next destination, Sean. Where the massage place is at? Oh gosh. Is it her? No. Oh, I don't remember. Was it even Veilstone? Lady Platinum. All right, never mind. She is here. The one, the house near the gym. I was right. And a Patrusu. Yes, excellent. Oh, you want me to show you how to... Yes, yes, I want to massage. What? Okay, never mind. I have to wait until 4 in the morning, I guess. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, right? <laughs> oh, I just wasted my time going all the way back. I tried to do no encounter, but it's fine. Oh, <laughs> cricket tune. Pure bug type. What can cricket tune have? I don't even know if I'm being honest. Swarm, I think they have his ability. Cricket tune ability. Oh, shed skin or runaway. I guess when it evolves, it gets it. Shed skin, it heals upon, you know, heals randomly. And runaway, it can run no matter what level. So 
if you're level 1 and you run to a level 100, you can run away no matter what. Okay, um... Let me demonstrate my technique. It's how just grown up battles. Beauty Sydney would like to battle with a Glam Meow. Level 29. We are gonna go into Shady. Oh, nice, Shady. I just noticed that's 102 HP. Nice. Nice! Glam Meow was defeated. Defeated Beauty Sydney. Oh my gosh, you're attacked that savagely? 1624 progress win, and you look more of a trainer than you look. What's over here? A honey tree. Okay, there's gotta be an item, though, right? A hyper potion, okay. I mean, I, I accept free items. There's something on top of this big cliff here. My instinct tell me that, but how am I supposed to climb up? Um, that's an excellent question. You need rock climb, my friend. No hidden items. Oh, we have rock smash. I believe this is a TM. I can be wrong. TM40 Aerial Ace. Oh! Um. I mean, I can definitely save that. We got a Yappa Berry. Oh, wait. I didn't get my encounter yet. Two Rot Berries. Yappa, I think, is recover HP or, um, for Poffins. Pokeblocks. Um, and this is a Agua Berry. That's, uh, for healing. Certain Pokemon will like those, depending on the taste. Alright, so we're done with this area. Oh, Alright, my encounter for all 213 is... Huh. Oh, well, that's dupes. Shall lost. Twenty-four. Hold me, John and Bryant. All right, Blade. Please evolve. Please, Blade. Blade, I beg of you. I beg of you. Evolve. Oh my goodness. My encounter for our 213 is. Okay. A weasel level 25 female. Mark Sheriff fan. I am as well. Let's go for Sunspore. Sunspore. Okay, it has Aqua Jet. It's like quick attack before the water type Pokemon. Okay, you gotta relax, Weasel. I'm going for a nap on me on you. Nice! Gotcha, Weasel was caught. Weasel's data will be added to the Pokédex. As we speak, Weasel! The Sea Weasel Pokémon! Pure water type. It spins its two tails like a screw to propel itself through water. The tails also slice cling and seaweed. Um, if you were a male, I would name you Swiper, like Swiper the Fox from Dora the Explorer. Swiper no swiping, but you're a female, so I can't do that. Uh, I'm gonna call you Seaweed, because you chopped through seaweed. I don't know. Seaweed. Drain. 
mud bomb. Right. Blade. Ooh, it's level 36! Blade. Blade. Blade? What? <sighs> Blade doesn't want to evolve. <laughs> <laughs> a wingle could have been here. Oh, keen eye as its ability. Or hand ability drizzle. Water flying type falls into Palaver. Oh my god. Okay, we're done. Okay, well, we are finished. Listen, do you know about the Battle Frontier? Yes, I guess you're someone who's already know. I hear it's a fun place for facilities for battle and do under different set of rules. Yes, and it's for competitive. Footprints are left to the sand when you walk on the beach. Pokemon seem to do a leave a footprint as much as people. Alright, I've been streaming for 27 minutes now. And I arrived at Pastoria City. Oh, look, a little Krogunk. You can become a Krogunk. I believe we're gonna have a very important battle, very important rival battle. That's a trainer, I believe. Um, but we're gonna save all this for the next part. So let me heal up. I haven't viewed the Pokemon that I've caught in a while, so we'll do that too. Move, and we'll start with Dusk. What berry is that? Caspi berry? Jolly nature! Oh my gosh! Very bulky Pokemon. Knocked Owl. Insomnia. Okay, cannot be put to sleep. Oh, very special defensive. Scyther. Oh, has technician! Oh, that's so good. That means moves that are base power of 60 or less get boosted. Oh my goodness, that is very good. Smoke, early bird adds ability. What a special uh, HP and special attack stats. Wait, oh, 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 I'm missing someone. We have seaweed with the walking berry. Does that lower water type move? Like super effective? I'm not sure. Swift Swim has ability, okay. Oh. I mean, there's some good Pokemon here, and you know, in the box. So we're gonna save immediately. Alright. So this video and commentary is coming to an end. But let me give you guys a quick team recap right after this saving all the data is done. Okay. First up, I have my starter Pokemon, my partner Pokemon, Shady the male print puppet, level 35, pure water type, carry with the cherry berry, one level away from a from an Empoleon. That beautiful jolly nature and those balanced stats, torn as ability in that Beautiful 102 HP Rock and Moves, Bubble Beam, Brine, Defog, and Grass Knot. Next up, we have Shelly the Male Shala Gastrodon. Hello. We have Shelly the Male Gastrodon at level 35, Water Ground type with the Quick Claw. Storm Drain as his ability Rock and Moves, Hidden Power, Rain Dance, Water Pulse, and Earthquake. Next up, we have Star the Female Star at level 35, Normal Flying type with the Trust Cover, about to be level 36. Intimidate as her ability Rock and Moves, Fly, Air Release, Close Combat, and Return. Next up we have Plump, the female Barbaro, level 35, normal water type with the Razor Fang. Simple as her ability, Rock and Moves Headbutt, Roll Out, Defense Pro, and Rock Smash. Next up we have Bullseye, the male Ponytail, level 35. He is 5 levels away from me, Rabidash, with the Tresco Berry. Flash Fire as ability, Rock and Moves Stomp, Tail Whip, Fire Spin, and Flame Wheel. And last but not we have Blade, the male Badoo, level 36, Grass Poison type with Soothe Brow. Apparently will not evolve no matter how much I try. Poison Point as her ability, Rock, as his ability, hello. As his ability, Rock and Moves, Mega Drain, Flash, Cut, and Sun's Fork. Poison Point as his ability. And you get a Footprint Ribbon as well. 
So in this part, I cleared out route. I mean, I cleared out Lake Valorfront except the restaurant because it's only during the day. And I got that sweet key for that girl, so you, she could go back to her suite. And I got um, TM40 aerial ace on route 213, and I got TM92 trick room and I route and uh, Lake Valorfront from one of the clowns. I've been streaming for almost 32 minutes, or going to 32 minutes in a little bit. And that's it. And I cleared our route 213. So, this has been part 18 of my Let's Play Pokemon Planet Nuzlocke Journey. It will continue, don't worry. I cleared out route 213 at Lake Valorfront, like I said. Stay tuned for part 19, where we will progress, of course. And we're gonna go to Pastoria City and get our fifth badge. It's water. I don't have any... Uh, electric type attacks so it's gonna be a fun gym um I wait what am I saying I have grass knot on frame flop I can see how much that will do I also have mega drain on blade but I would love blade to evolve I'm gonna test this out but first this video will come to, is coming to an end this is Jojo93 thank you guys for watching stay safe as always hope you all have a happy and healthy weekend I hope I enjoy my vacation I know I will and Stay tuned for the next part, part 19. Stay safe as always. I love you all. Thank you all for all the support. And I will catch you guys next time. And don't worry, I saved. So if this doesn't work, I will just close this down anyway. Um, you never know. Lake Resolve 37? I don't get it. Yep. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> I'll catch you guys next time.